What's up, America? This is old Jim Bob from Jim Bob's Fake News Network coming to you from our beautiful studios in downtown Burbank, California. Yes, that's where we are. Well, last night I watched President Trump on the news declaring his uh, bid for the wall with Congress and uh, telling America that it was a crisis and that we had to get uh, that wall passed or Washington ain't never going to get opened up again. And uh, I thought he was very presidential appearance, and uh, I was very uh, uh, surprised and uh, pleased to see how he had changed the wall into uh, a humanitarian effort to help mankind and uh, to help the world. It's not a wall to keep people out. It's a wall to help the Mexicans who are trying to get in and the Americans on the other side of the wall. He's going to protect Americans on the other side from the 200,000 or so uh, criminals that got caught trying to get through uh, into uh, America at the airports, not at the wall. And, uh, and he's going to protect the mothers whose uh, children had died uh, by sending them back to their country so they could die there. It's very humanitarian and very compassionate now. And uh, it's an emergency and it has to be dealt with. And so uh, I found that uh, very interesting and, uh, and, and very presidential. And uh, he also has conceded, uh, which means he's trying to work with Washington, that instead of a concrete wall, he'd be willing to have a steel wall built. That's what the Democrats, Nancy Pelosi, would like to have. And uh, so he's agreed to, to do that. So he's trying to give on his part and get it all done and everything. So. Uh, you know, uh, he, he lives there in uh, Mar Largo down there in Palm Beach. It's got a wall all the way around the top of it with glass on top of it. I used to see that when I was a child. Anyhow, uh, that's his... Uh, oh, I stand by just a minute. Uh, my gracious, I can't believe who just came in the studio. I want to try to get him on the air here. He's, uh, he's a well-known Jim Bob from Jim Bob's Commentary Channel has just come in the studio. Let me see if I can get him to comment on uh, the presidential speech last night. Jim Bob, could you come over here for a minute and uh, please uh, tell uh, my audience uh, what you think about the president's um, uh, speech last night? Oh, you will? Okay, he's gonna be on. Just stand by just a minute. Thank you, so hey, stand by. Well, thank you, son. It's good to see you. I see you. I remember you when you was a nobody, uh, just a, a little uh, fledgling uh, reporter coming up. And now you're still a nobody uh, on your fake news network. Anyways, uh, what are you doing, son? Well, you want to know what I think about Trump's speech last night? I think it's amazing to me how dumb everybody is up there in Washington, D.C. Uh, they're going to now build the wall out of steel. As I reported earlier on one of my reports, you know what's going to happen. The scrappers, the metal scrappers, they're going down there and they're going to get all that metal. They're so happy today. They're all loading their trucks up and heading to Mexico. And they're going to go down there and get all that steel. And uh, as far as uh, that goes, I also got a scoop uh, for you. That's why I come by today to give you a scoop about uh, what I heard from uh, my unreliable sources. I got them too, you know. And they tell me that uh, Trump's not going to stop with the Mexican wall. He's going all the way around the United States, up to Canada, everywhere. He's going to build the whole thing around the whole United States of America. He's even going to build it up and down the ocean coasts and everything. And uh, he's going to keep all the criminals out and all the criminals in there's uh over uh, you know, about 19 million felonies in the united states of america and so when he gets that wall built up he'll have them all inside they'll be glad because that way the the uh 200,000 he's gonna keep out from mexico won't be in competition with them for their crime and stuff like that so yeah i've got an opinion on uh trump and his wall and Everybody knows I'm no fan of him. So anyways, uh, I'll give the uh, show back to you, and it's good to see you. You keep on trying, boy. You'll get there. Sooner or later, somebody will watch your show. All right, Jim Bob's going to get out of here now and let you come back. Yeah. Well, well, boy. Man, I tell you, that's exciting. Uh, Jim Bob was my mentor when I started out in the news business and. uh I was really excited to have him come on the show and everything. I got kind of a little bit excited about that. So, well, uh, so that's uh, his take on everything. And 
and uh, mine is uh, uh, very similar, I, although I report just the news that's coming on and everything, even though it may be fake news, it's the real news, the real fake news. And uh, so there you have it, uh, Jim Bob from Jim Bob's Fake News Network and his uh, confederate, confederate uh, compadre uh, there, uh, Jim Bob from Jim Bob's Commentary Channel, sister channel on YouTube. And uh, we appreciate you watching and uh, please subscribe. Jim Bob's out.